Good day everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Herbert Sophia and today po nandito ako sa beautiful place as you can see nasa Eastern Finland again but this time nandito na po kami sa Savon Lina. Okay everyone, at this moment, alam ko nakikita nyo na yung nasa likod ko. Ito po yung pinuntahan namin dito sa Sabunlina. And ito po yung castle na sinasabi ko, Ola Venlina Castle dito po sa Sabunlina, Eastern Finland. At the moment po medyo makulimlim, but later on, uh, araw po based sa uh, forecast. Napakaganda ng castle na to at mamaya itutour natin to sa loob. Ayun oh, yung castle. Ah, wow guys, look at that. Diyan po tayo pupunta mamaya, yung castle na yan. That's Ola Vinlina Castle dito po sa Sabonlina. Wow, ang ganda niya. Okay, see you later. Alright uh, guys, pupunta na tayo sa Sabunlina and most of the people are uh, sleeping dito sa mga tents nila and sa cottages samahan nyo kami and let's go second day here in Pungkaharyu Alright guys, eto na po ang uh, aming train ayan, si baby cutie train oh my god ang liit nya Let's go! Alright guys, first stop going to uh, Sabunlina is uh, Kerry Maki or Kering Kerry natin ito. So it will take us like uh, 20 minutes from Red Red Trip Pung Kaharyu to Sabunlina. Ayan, napakatahimik po at uh, provincial provincial ang uh, dating ng mga dinadaanan natin. Guys, look at that. Diyan po tayo pupunta mamaya. Yung castle na yan. That's Ola Vinlina Castle. Dito po sa Sabonlina. Wow. Ang ganda niya. Okay. See you later. Yan. So, dito na po tayo pababa guys. Sabonlina po. Go Angels. Hey. Yeah. 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 Then, theater dito at mga yate dito. Napakaganda guys. Alright guys, uh, on this bistro, so, uh, meron silang uh, breakfast offer. You can get a sandwich. Yung nandun. Kumuha na ako ng isang sandwich. Yan. Ham and cheese sandwich. And then, if you want, you can combine that with puro or porridge dito sa Finland then in uh, this situation so I can add some muesli then meron silang uh, apple with cinnamon mmm okay, smell it tagyan yeah. natin kasi masarap to sa porridge i-mix ko para masaya <laughs> then meron silang uh, fresh pickled berries mixed berries to ayan ayan ang uh, iba't ibang klase or five kinds ng berries nandito so para may sourness then meron din na uh, jam just a bit ayan so 
is a beautiful breakfast now so meron silang apple juice doon meron water then nandun yung mga porridge so coffee kasama na included and the price is only 7 euro and 90 cents so sandwich porridge and coffee or tea or milk and juice so kasama na po yun sa offer nila so all right let's uh, get started sa breakfast Ayan. And everything good? Alright. So we choose this area kasi actually maraming mga table doon. But uh, dito, nasa likod lang namin itong uh, river, riverside. Ayan. Medyo mahalin pa guys. So makain muna kami ng breakfast. Alright guys, our breakfast is over. It's a healthy, delicious. Thank you very much as chef. Napakabait and napaka-welcoming ng mga tao na sa loob. And then, if you were in Sabun Lina, try to uh, check this place. They have breakfast, uh, buffet lunch, and dinner a la carte as well. So, Corpi Bistro in Sabun Lina. Malapit lang po ito sa train station ng Sabun Lina. Please check this uh, bistro out. Alright guys, from the uh, Corpi Bistro. So, heading kami dito sa summer market nila. It's uh, plus 20 at the moment but uh, medyo makulimlim. Ayan. So, ito check natin tong uh, summer market nila around kung anong mga tinitinda nila dito bago tayo pumunta sa castle. Best thing dito is like Nasa gilid lang ang uh, market na itong river. Yeah. And then sabi ng uh, waitress sa Corpi restaurant. So if you wanna go straight sa castle, just follow this river kasi it will pass or end up there. So, wow. Napakaganda dito guys. Uh, just, we just follow this uh, castle. Then, uh, as I can see there, there's uh, Sabunina University of Applied Sciences. Ooh. And dito meron sila mga fresh fruits and vegetables. And Uh, look at this guys, uh, medyo nandito ako sa isang uh, shop na ito It's uh, kind of uh, different because Ayan, mayroon mga wood drops Okay, this was uh, really handmade, hand carved Ayan, salmon, look Ang ganda-ganda Ayan, mayroon pang sa dito, look And ito, wow, I think this was a tree so ginawa niyang ganito, napakaganda guys napakaganda wow, ito merong uh, uh, ano to? reindeer horn wow, ang galing and, and then meron pang clock nice daddy no? did you make this? did you make it? wow, siya pala yung gumawa alright, beautiful ano yung paano ilang? wow laya, what's that? ano tawag dyan? hat wow Looks good to you, alright? Okay, let's go to the castle na? Yes. Okay, let's head to the uh, flow of the river kasi yun na ang sabi. So, pupunta na po kami sa castle ngayon. Then, ito, tingnan nyo guys. Uh, really old ship but uh, ang ganda niya pa rin tingnan. Galing, the preserve nila. Yan. Ito pala na sa Bulina. It's nice. Especially pag summer. Ayan, no? Tignan nyo. Ganda. Guys, eto na. Nandito na kami sa bridge. Uh, papunta ito sa Ola Binilina Castle. Sabay-bayan nyo kami. 
para makita nyo ang ganda ng castle na to ayun na guys eto na papasok na tayo sa castle ang ganda oh my god eh. and sa side dito sa kanan nandito ang uh, um, mapa but uh, tingnan nyo to guys oh my god oh labin lina castle dito po ito sa sabon lina Yes guys, at the moment uh, tinataas niya yung uh, part ng bridge so bumalik kami together with other uh, guests na magpupunta sa castle and then as uh, nakikita nyo nagbumove ang bridge ang bilis ha yan so I'm not sure kung uh, anong barko ang papasok but uh, ayan bumukas ang bridge nandito na po kami ngayon sa Olavin Lina Castle dito po sa Sabon Lina and then uh, we are waiting po para sa guided tour namin and halika po subaybayan natin at ipakita ko sa inyo ang ganda ng castle na to Yun na yung uh, tourist namin. Ito na po, nakapasok na kami sa castle. And nakita na namin yung guide. So, I think much easier kasi meron na kami uh, reserve uh, ticket online. Kaya mas mabilis po nakapasok. So I will just give you a little reservation yes. paper because we have very limited groups, only 20 people maximum, so, so I just write in this paper. Ayan na guys, uh, i-reserve nyo na kami kasi 11 o'clock so pa but uh, maghihintay muna kami sa isang area Alright So you can go to the permanent exhibition It's in the tunnel here Okay For example, or you can go to the main castle It's in the yellow building When you go through this tunnel and turn left yes. There is the main castle rooms like in Skoll and yeah. rooms like this So you can see around a little bit before the okay. guided tour And then just come back here Here, yes, okay. yes. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh my god guys, tingnan niyo tong kanyo na to. Para tayong nasa corridor. Uh, <laughs> laya, natamaan ka niyan. <laughs> All right, merong isa dito, dalawa, tatlo, apat, hanggang doon. Parang corridor ang style nito, guys. So in 15 minutes magsisimula na yung uh, guided tour natin alright guys eto na magsisimula na ang ating uh, English guided tour ang sub ni na pasok Alright guys, sa loob medyo mayroong mga bilihan ng mga souvenir but uh, dito tayo okay. Okay, may mga toilets Ayan. New settlers came also from southern Finland, from Uusi 
Mohan Padme, uh, the beautiful castle, uh, the peasants, uh, the uh, I mean, they finished their taxes by uh, building the castle and bringing more uh, um, raw material here, the stones and the uh, limestone here. And uh, this was uh, quite a small place um, in the Middle Ages. They didn't uh, sit on the fuse. Alright, guys, nandito kami ngayon papunta sa chamber. At napakaganda ng lugar. Chamber nandun. Ayan, like a open area. Ayan. Ang ganda niya. Nasa tower kami. Isa. Ayan, itong tower na ito. Ang ganda ng situation dito. Ayan. Then, silipin natin sa taas na ito. Ayan. Yan po makikita sa side na to. Yan, balik na tayo sa guided tour. Yan, dito na tayo sa sa baba na isang tower. Wow. Dito na tayo. Um, Already in the 16th century, they started to strengthen and fortify the castle, especially in uh, the eastern side, uh, the Bailey Board. Um, the artillery and the cannons got uh, more developed and stronger, uh, so they had to also strengthen the walls against the enemy's uh, weapons. And uh, later, they also built so called uh, double wall and uh, they built uh, the gap uh, with sand and soil and uh, built this uh, cannon decks for their own artillery uh, and batteries and uh, during that time they also Ito guys, isa sa tower side so ang ganda talaga ng view na ito talagang strategically na location na ito para makompress nila ang mga tao noong uh, panahon ng gera Alright guys Tingnan nyo yung isang side ng uh, castle na to. Nandun yung dalawang tower. Nandito yung isa. So, masyadong mataas. Okay, continue tayo guys. Napaka taas ng pinanggalingan namin. Simula sa church. Then sa isang tower. And then ngayon, pababa kami. Ayan po, itataas yung camera. Para makita nyo ang beauty ng castle na ito. Ayan po. Napakaganda. Wow. Very nice po. na to. I think ito yung kinonvert nila now a day sa a theater from an old castle they turned it into a, a beautiful theater yan ang ganda yeah napakaganda but because of pandemic wala ngayon nagaganap dito nga Occasions. Ayan guys. Wow. Isa daw to. Isa sa beautiful area. Or secret area. Noong unang panahon. Ayan. Pakinggan natin ang uh, sasabihin niya. Now we are in the eastern most part of the island. Uh, here the Russians uh, still built an outdoor 
of work. Uh, and the modern channel for the drinking water because the castle didn't have any uh, well where they could have a safety from the water inside the wall. And that was seen um, then a problem in the last battle uh, which was late in the uh, war of Gustav III in the 1780s. And after the war ended, the Russians uh, fortified and modernized this old castle in uh, uh, the old Finland, uh, Vata Suomi, uh, which was um, annexed to Russia uh, after the Treaty of Turku. Hello guys, ito daw yung uh, noong unang panahon dito nila pinapadaan ang uh, waterways nila which is a drinkable waterway noong unang panahon so papasok yung buod sa kase, paikot para magkaroon daw ng uh, uh, a clear or clean water ang uh, mga tao noong mga unang panahon and then sa side na ito hindi ko alam kung pupunta tayo dito but nakakaganda uh, guys Lalayo muna tayo sa guided tour but wow! Look at this! Ang ganda! Ayan, dito papasok papunta doon ang uh, tubig Wow, napakaganda! Majestic! Majestic! Ang uh, at awesome nitong uh, area na to Ayan, may mga ibon and then may food para magbigot dala siguro ng mga pagkain ng ulang panahon yan na po yung uh, isang uh, eastern side ng uh, uh, castle na ito at pwede makaikot ang ferry balik tayo sa guided tour haha <laughs> sabi daw niya na yung unang panahon ito ay isa pinaka warm place sa castle na ito and karamihan daw puro barracks ito ng mga tao and then marami sila nakita mga uh, stones or canyon stones dito sa area na ito at uh, ito daw dito daw tinatago ang mga armaments because it sank a long time uh, it wasn't built on a good foundation and it was infamously called the Black Tower because of the bad condition and already in the 1560s it was replaced by a thicker hotel an artillery tower that yeah. the German architect and the tower here is guys a Black Tower because it's always a place to go 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 Ito po yung side niya na makikita. Napakaganda niya ngayon. Ba't naman daw ito dahil ito laging sila. Alright guys, uh, natapos na yung aming uh, guided tour. So, it's time for uh, lunch naman. Alright guys, uh, palabas na kami ng uh, castle. Ang dami ng tao ngayon is 12 o'clock so it takes like one hour itong uh, guided tour Ayan It's uh, time for lunch naman Ayan So by uh, Kasem Time for us to take some lunch Ang ganda ng view ng uh, castle dito Ito yung museum nila guys Rikisari Museo yeah. Ito yung mga 
boat noong unang panahon ang mga ginamit nila same as uh, in uh, Terbesari dito may mga boots summer boots offers and at this moment guys we visit kami dito sa church ng Sabulina samahan nyo kami para makapag uh, Pasalamat na daging safe po ang aming travel dito. Okay, we are here na po sa church na Sabulina. Nasa hill area po siya kaya mahangin. Eh, let's see pa uh, bukas. Thank you guys. Ito na nakapasok tayo sa church ng Salundina. Napakaganda po na simbahan dito sa Sabolina, Finland. Look, Jay! Dito, Jay! And guys, ito po, uh, fresh wild raspberry. Ayan po. Tikman natin. Sarap yan. Ayan. Ayan, ito po. Raspberry siya. Mmm. Ang tamis. <laughs> Gawa pa tayo. Ayan. Ayan, ang dami oh. Ito po nagkalat, raspberry naman. Ayan. Ito po medyo maliliit kasi it's a wild one. At uh, ang tamis pa rin. Ayan. Suwabe. Ang sarap. Ayan po, ang dami oh. Ayan oh. Ayan. Sorry, nakukuberan siya. Ang dami po raspberry dito. Ang sarap. Hey guys, it's a blueberry season na ngayon. Ayan po, ang dami. Nagkalat dito. Grabe. Ayan. Blueberry po in the house. Ang nandun po yan. Puro blueberry. Grabe. Hey everyone, hopefully nag-enjoy kayo sa video ko about the vlogs of uh, Sabolina and Kungkaharyu. So if you like this video, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. See you in my next video.